Arkansas has got one and Courtney Fortson leading the Razorbacks to the top of the West standings. There is the first made bucket. For DeMarcus Cousins back into the game, backing down on Storm Warren and dunking down right on top of Storm Warren. What a play. Cousins early, they want to establish his play around the basket early in the game. Marcus tries to strip it from Bass, and that helps Spencer to the hoop, blocked by Miller. And now the Cats on the run. Wall, Cousins. Nice play by John Wall, and nice finish by DeMarcus Cousins. I like the fact that John Wall understands that he can use his fast break, and DeMarcus Cousins again, concentrating with the foul, finishing it. Base for a moment, Wall closes out on him, give and go. Warren blocks at the rim. Wow, what a block by Patrick Patterson. About as well executed of a play as you could have, and Patrick Patterson out of nowhere. This for Arkansas, the point guard play in this league has just been so good through the first half of the conference play. Fast blocked by Orton. Wildcats guarding the basket again, leading to the run out. Bledsoe to Ramon Harris, who spins it in. Boy, what a tough shot by Ramon Harris. Could have been. Welcome back to the scoring column, Ramon Harris. Daniel Orton on the block. Again, Kentucky's interior defense protecting the basket. And again, Ramon Harris concentrating. Patterson sprints down to the block. Backing in on Mitchell. Over Tasman Mitchell. Patrick Patterson. Something that some people forget about this Kentucky team. Patrick Patterson's John Calipari that just hangs around as far as playing time goes. He, he just always finds a way to play. Terrific rebound by the big young freshman. Playing well, but the role players are doing their job as well. So off this miss from Patterson, there's Orton for a very difficult play. Just hanging around. Hanging out for Cousins. Catches in the paint. Misses. Stick back. No. Patterson there to help him out. Kentucky just staying with it around the rim. A little bit like volleyball up there. Just tapping it around. And you've got Cousins and Patterson and to 20%. Steal by Bledsoe. Eric Bledsoe. Finger rolls it in. Out of the timeout. Turnover LSU. Easy two for Kentucky. Well, six out of their last seven, which is what you need to do to get the turnovers. You've got to earn your way in. Cousins foul. Count it. He is just too big, too strong, too talented. Storm Warren, a little bit undersized from a height. LSU elected not to double team DeMarcus Cousins. They're playing him one on one. DeMarcus Cousins, his ability to stay with it, keep his pivot foot on the ground. So, Patterson now with eight points, or rather, a Cousins with eight points, four rebounds. Calipari, 13 years, was a head coach at Youngstown State, and the team of. Those guys together. Wow, the athleticism from a point guard. From a point guard, Eric Bledsoe. Now you also watch. Let's watch this. Wall. Wow. Wow. Brought Carter out of his seat. How about the freshman for Kentucky, DeMarcus Cousins, on an offensive tip in, and Eric Bledsoe at about six foot tall, six foot one, maybe. Here's John Wall pushing it in the break. How about that play? He makes that play look easy. Bo Spencer tries to steal it. Wall goes behind the back. You know who'd love that? Pistol Pete Maravich. <laughs> I mean, did that not look like a little pistol move in the open? He's at LSU, but. That is that is reminiscent of the type of play. Now, if John Wall does the 90-foot, let the Rebels get back into the game. Well, there's been a little bit of talk even lately of John Wall maybe not playing as well as he did early. DeMarcus Cousins again. But John Wall is running this basketball team. Oh, they have so many weapons. Pick and roll. Wall, Patrick Patterson, case in point. We forget that a year ago, they can give him a little bit of confidence in the second half of SEC play. Triple goes down for DeAndre Liggins. You know, I like DeAndre Liggins. 
Bledsoe gets a screen from Cousins. DeMarcus Cousins backing in on Storm Warren, spinning away, finishing with the left. 17 now for DeMarcus Cousins. Without a double team. Bass asks for energy from the LSU fans. They respond. Cousins off the double, finds Dodd. Last possessions of finishing the defensive possession with a rebound. Dodson off the weave, count it. <laughs> this might be the score at the turn, 50 to 26. Patrick Patterson, Kentucky again, going inside. So many different weapons offensively. He's being aggressive, taking the ball inside, going around the rim. Warren swatted out by Daniel Orton. Up ahead, dunk for Ramon Harris. What a terrific pass by John Wall, the way he led Ramon Harris. The Tigers fight on despite being down 28 at the half. Dodson answers with a three. How about Rudy Macklin, his first collegiate game, 32 rebounds. Bledsoe the poke and the layup. Eric Bledsoe is so quick. He gets it so. The hope among LSU fans is Tasman Mitchell can get to that 2,000 mark. Wall ahead to Bledsoe. Time for the Kentucky Wildcats. Wall right through the defense to a cutting Bledsoe. With English, Bledsoe lays it in. Kentucky has its largest lead at 33 points on LSU. Well, John Wall's back to having fun. Calipari wanted to be coached up by a guy who's sent players into the NBA lottery time and time again. Coached in the NBA with the New Jersey. So played together back in the day, college. DeAndre Liggins steps out for a three. John Calipari nods because he really likes what he's seen. Patterson hits the three. And Patrick Patterson, who did down here. Now, Mark Ewan, Ludwig, blocked by Dodson after a look who was with us every step of the way. I'm going to enjoy walking into a place where they are with me from the get-go. And they certainly are. And John Hood, a part of this freshman recruiting class that has been so highly touted this year to get Kentucky on the run. And again, sometimes those meetings come where they see 155. But I like the fact that LSU kept fighting. I like the fact that Trent Johnson's team did not lay down. They kept competing. So John Calipari and Trent Johnson, two coaches who have a lot of admiration for one another, shake hands at midcourt. 81-55, impressive win for Kentucky. Well, a very impressive win to go on the road after the South Carolina loss. Come back and do it in a dominating fashion is what this team needed from a mental standpoint. For Mark Gottfried and our crew, I'm Carter Blackburn. Now we send you to win in the SEC Network Studio.